Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And last time we kind of strolled through most of the uh, lab area over here. Uh, and we found a device we need. But now we need to go back to the start. Because there's a spot back near the entrance where we can use it. The nap room. We're going to take a nap. Nap on the job. Put some zombies down for a nap. Permanently. What other nap jokes? I don't know. So this way, there shouldn't... Light, please, thank you. There shouldn't be any other enemies. They should all be dead. Huh, he's still dead. The only one that's not going to be dead is uh, the one in there that's going to get up, but that's why we have our shotgun out. Okay, so you notice on here, here's how we're going to use this thing. We've got MUF, and it shows our little... Uh, signal modulator here so we're going to examine it and uh, it is a key item probably electric power okay so we need muf and what we have to do is we have to sequence these how do i oh, oh. nope Oh, okay, the right stick does that. Okay. And th you just have to get the wavelengths to match up. There we go. Uh, you'll get a little vibration in the controller too when you uh, got it correct. So once you have that, we have the muff. We can stick it in here. And it will reactivate the power. And yeah, homeboy's gonna get up. What the? Took two shotgun shells. Oh, how? Oh, I never gotten that one before. Okay, well, we found it. A hit pouch. Wow, we have even more inventory space. So that shouldn't be an issue ever. And uh, that is the last of the stuff. Oh, well, we have a notebook. Wayne Lee's notebook. Oh, this is the Dr. Lee. Yeah, because we took his wristband. Blood everywhere. What's happening? They're all dead. Those men in black. USS Headquarters Special Forces, but why? Okay, um... Yeah, yeah, you're... You're dead, Dr. Lee. Ugh. And with power on, there shouldn't be anything else. Well, we could go into a uh, lit up cafeteria. We don't have a reason to. There's no other reason to be anywhere this way. Just want to make sure that nothing spawns. But yeah, okay. It was just the one zombie. So with that, we can head back over this way. And now there's a couple things that we need to do. We need to get... We need to get our cartridge full. We should probably just do that first before going back down into the one area to turn the power on. Oh, 
And both things are kind of... Uh, we might need this. Oh, this isn't where we put in codes. That's where we need level 3 access. Oh, he's, uh... He's alive. And he's not alive anymore. Fire is definitely how you want to deal with the plant zombies. Because they are no joke. First time through here I'd like burn through all of the fire in the sewer and on that uh, that boss battle. And uh, yes, yeah, so I was like pistol shooting those guys like all the way through and it was it was manageable at first but it became a pain later okay so two zero okay i guess that last part is a seven six seven okay so two zero six seven and yeah we may as well go get that taken care of before we do anything else. Yep, they're still dead. And I don't think we're going to get anything else in here. Now we have a really kind of obnoxious... I forgot to bring the thing. Need to go get the thing. This is why we killed everything. That way there's just no danger. empty cartridge so we can fill the cartridge with uh, my pick for the most annoying puzzle in the game. I could probably make a triple green herb out of these three. I don't really have a reason not to. Uh, yeah, that's what we need. And now that we've used that uh, code the trophy is done, and we can refill our flamethrower. Okay, well, let's head back through. Also, when you don't grab the key items uh, at the right times, you'll have to come back through multiple times for uh, inventory management. I mean, hell, this music still creeps me out. But there's no danger there. Okay, so now we put this in here. Manual mode engaged. Yeah, Adjust so... Adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity. Yeah, that's what we do. Um, and pressing this will only work once we have uh, up to that red laser line. So the way we do this... Oh, we fill. I don't even think we wanted to do it like that. I remember how to do this. Okay, so we have a little bit left there. I don't think that's where we want the little bit left.
I think it is. Because we do that. Oh, whoops. And we do that. Once you have exactly enough, the game will give it to you. And is this? Oh, hey, that is it. That gives us the exact amount. I don't know why you have to do it like that. Uh, first time playing this game, and even on subsequent playthroughs, like uh, this would be like a five minute puzzle for me. Fortunately, there's no danger. And with that, we have everything here in the uh, drug testing lab. So at this point, like we can go back up this way and back down these stairs, or we can just take this path through and go through here. Both of them are kind of equal distant, and we've killed all of the enemies, so... Oh, actually... Actually... I should go back through this way. Because I think a plant zombie will appear this way. Yeah, we have one more plant zombie we need to kill. And I do want to kill it. Although, I suppose it shouldn't matter too much. It really shouldn't matter if we kill this one or not. And we're approaching from this way. And I still don't think... Yeah, it's not going to be here until we turn the power on. And I don't necessarily need to even run back this way when I've got the power on. Okay. I was trying to listen for any more of those bobbleheads if there was one in that corner. Alrighty then. Liquors are dead here. So there should be absolutely no danger. I'm gonna walk though. Just in case we do still have a liquor infestation going on. But I thought for sure there was only two liquors in this room. Uh, nothing else is going to get up. Because we killed them all already. Okay, so you can see this is the Mur Or Murph. Examine. Oh. Oh, nope. Murph. Oh, hey, they got it pretty quickly there. That well, turns the power back on. Uh, we still have a use for this somewhere. Very well. So where we need to go now... There's the server room, and there's the low temp testing lab. Let's go to the server room. I'm going to walk just in case more liquors appear. Just in case. No, there, there shouldn't be. Yeah, we come through this area so many times. There shouldn't be any danger in here. In fact, I think this even has a save point if you want one. Oh, fuel. Yep, it's got a save point. So it's going to be one of our safe rooms. Uh, let's just drop that stuff off. We've got way more inventory space than what we need. I don't... I don't think we really need any more... 
special inventory. Oh, we still have items in here. Yeah, we uh, have a combat. I will grab that. I'll drop a save here. Why not? There might be enemies down the other hallway we have to contend with. There might be liquors. Is there a liquor down that hallway? Let's grab a hand grenade. I have the three. I don't necessarily want to use three. We'll do that. Let's just charge ahead. And this is still... Oh, because uh, things got destroyed. This... I don't think there's... No, there's no enemies here. Just not at the moment. Not at the moment. Ugh. I want items, though. Give me items. Welcome back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. I don't know if I need to kill that or not. Oh, Wayne Lee's inbox. Rick Mendoza. What's he up to you? Uh, Cartwright, fuel your jets. Oh, fuel <laughs> cool your jets, not fuel your jets. Put the secret on the bottom. Oh, that tells you about the helix. We already know about that. Uh, greenhouse inspection. Put together the budget estimate and get it done tonight. We're under attack. People are dead. East area is cut off. Plant 43 is going wild, greenhouse, blah, blah, blah. Do you remember Susie the cheerleader? What a great gal. Okay. All from Rickman. Well, oh, that's from uh, Cartwright. That's just an informational thing. Here, Leon, I feel like you should be wearing one of those suits to be in here. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? <clears throat> yeah, this is the Sub Zero storage. How do we not get attacked in here? Gunpowder. Sure. We'll take gunpowder. Did we get attacked by this fruit cake? It's like six headshots, so he'll get right back up. Uh, this one, we don't have a puzzle to solve. We just have to put this in. It looks like there's going to be a puzzle, like you got to try and maneuver the crane or something to get it to the spot you need. Or do some sort of timing thing, but no, no, there's absolutely uh, nothing we need to do. You need to use the coolant on the liquid before you uh, dispense it. There's a document or something somewhere that tells you you needed to do that. How did we miss it? Oh well. Cooling complete. Trust me, it's what we need to do. And okay, that is all we got here. <clears throat> Just call me paranoid. 
This type of game just kind of does that to you. Even, even if you know everything. Okay, so if we take the stairs up, we're going to end up in the... Uh, Yeah, we'd end up in the uh, place where the plant zombie will be coming back to life. And I'm not super interested in that. What I am super interested in... This is getting back to this area. There shouldn't be any more... But it still sounds like there is. I don't know what gives with that. Okay, so level 3 wristband. We'll have to go to the presentation room, check out that senior staff ID. Uh, we're going to be running very soon. We we'll use this. Dispensing solution now. Yeah, because uh, some document somewhere tells you that uh, cold kills the those plants. That did the trick. Warning: You have dispersed a dangerous solution without authorization. Your actions have been logged, and you may be subject to disciplinary measures. You mean Dr. Lee's actions have been logged? <sighs> yeah, we can get to the other side. Okay, are we ready? No, we can't even get... No. Son of a bitch. Shit. Go away. Is that the reason I was still having sound in here? Because I never actually checked out the one on the stairs there? Apparently. Oh, wait. Yeah, we're gonna take this one out. I forgot that more of these guys come. let the flames kind of, you know, in, of inflame him. Right. Yeah, what the? the hell? Okay, yeah, it is smart to get rid of those guys. And we just happen to have, you know, enough ammo to take everything uh, down. Alright. Oh, that scientist almost looks okay, except he's probably dead. Uh, electronic chip. Let's go! That is who you think it is. Shit! Him again? Yeah. Uh, the tyrant is back. We can combine this. And he will run into the save room 
over this way. This is why we want to have all these zombies dead. And just have the enemies in general cleared out. I'm going to read this real quick. Byron Cartwright's inbox. High priority, increased security. Why did Nest become a nest for spies? Oh, that's center from William Birkin. He's an important guy. Uh, three last month and another four this month. And those are just the ones getting caught. I'll be restricting access to the west area today. Ignore all requests from headquarters for information on G. Those suits contribute nothing to this project anyways. Sender, no reply, auto-generated mail. Unauthorized access detected. Oh. Huh, see, Wayne Lee is getting blamed for that. Let's get out of here because he is still coming. Uh, so we gotta get the G's sample virus to the west side. We can save here real quick. That should actually be the bulk of things to do here. Uh, the tyrant will stalk around this whole area, so let's just get out of here. I don't think the tyrant comes out to this place. I could be wrong, though. Who knows? I don't remember exactly all where he goes. I just, I know I don't want him here. But we have access level 3 now. So let's get moving. Or let's pause the video here and uh, pick this up next time.